when I was in college, um, I had played soccer, um, competitive soccer, for about um, 20 years. Um, and then my junior year in college, actually my sophomore year in college, I, I just found out I, I wasn't getting the enjoyment I, I used to like in it. So started running um, and found something I just love to do, just to get out there and just, just have fun. Um, I ran my first marathon my junior year in college. And then after that, I just... Um, you know, got into to school and uh, actually I, I graduated from college and went off to um, working in a veterinary clinic and eventually to vet school, but my outlet was to go out and run and I got some of my best ideas running out there. Um, gradually I started advancing into trail running um, and uh, just again found something I love. You know, now I, I do a lot of, I used to do a lot of solo running with, with running with my iPod and I, now I run a lot with friends and I think my, my main motivators are my friends because they've encouraged me to do things, um, you know, do races and stuff, which I never really wanted to do. Um, but found out, you know, I like doing stuff like that and I, th I think your friends, you can learn a lot from your friends on your runs. Definitely the St. Jude Marathon this past year. That right. was, I I did not anticipate um, the, the, the time I got at all. I had no idea I'd run what I what I would run, but it, you know it felt good. Again, I just I just went by how I felt. Um, basically, I didn't I didn't go by any watches or anything like that. Just just how I felt, and that definitely was my my, my most prized run. I think the the craziest thing was um, when I was running around um, Patriot Lake one time, and I saw a dog um, who was chasing ducks in the lake, and um, he was swimming further and further into the center of the lake and his owner got concerned about him um, and was afraid he was drowning. Um, so I proceeded to jump in after him fully clothed with my shoes on and uh, he uh, kept on swimming further out and somebody from the side thought I was drowning so he jumped in after me um, and pulled me to the side and it wasn't until I saw he was very, very cute that I kind of went limp as a damsel in distress and he pulled me to the side um, and uh, you know, and then his wife came up, you know, and so, you know, it was kind of over there. All, all thoughts of, of a possible relationship are over, but um, the dog did make it, which was good, so.